Today marks the anniversary of the deadliest drunk driving crash in America. Three decades ago, 27 people were killed in the Carrollton bus crash, forever changing the lives of the families of those killed and the survivors. Alexa Helwig was at an event today honoring those victims. That's tonight's LEX 18 Big Story at 11. 30 years ago, the life of Darren Jaquess changed drastically. It makes you grow up overnight, you know, um, dealing with something like that, you know, it's, it's like, it almost feels like I was robbed in my teenage years. Jaquest was only 15 years old when the deadliest drunk driving crash in America forever changed his life and the 66 others that were on their way home from a church trip to an amusement park. Unless you were there that night, you really will never get it. Several survivors attended the event this morning and two of them spoke about the tragic day for the first time in public. Mothers Against Drunk Driving hoped to bring together the survivors, their families and community members to honor the 27 victims and discuss how to eliminate drunk driving, which remains the leading killer on our roads. We have lost over 375,000 Americans. Jaquest has three kids of his own, and on the 25th anniversary, he tells me his 15-year-old son at the time played a part in the reenactment for a documentary, which allowed for his kids to understand what he went through at their age. 30 years later, I understand. Um, I understand that, you know, things do happen. And it could have very well been one of my friends that, you know, created this. Um, I'm not mad about it. Um, I understand that, you know, there's a purpose for me in life. Covering the news in Hardin County, Alexa Helwig, LEX 18 News.